Hey, 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 welcome, welcome, welcome to Crystal's Daily Dose of Joy, welcome family, friends, and followers, if you're new, then hello, welcome, good morning, evening, afternoon, night, wherever you're at, whatever you're doing, I hope it's a blessed day, and so yes, y'all, we're going to do some cleaning, I do typically use the power hour, even when I'm not sharing it here on YouTube, but I'm just going to have a kind of a calm, peaceful cleaning today, it is a Saturday I just want to focus on the living room and the kitchen. Lots of little things to do. Um, and I will show you the before and after. I've been so, so not tired like sleepy, but just tired to give out between school in the mornings and the afternoon. Um, little Bear has been helping me, me and my son, a lot since he's been out for spring break. And then we just had so much personal going on. I don't share here on the platform. And so... Yes, I am going to just do everything and get it done and get it back tied up, and I'll show you the before and after. So first, I want to open up the curtain. Um, I normally open up one side. I might open up both. I'll see how the sunlight looks. Right here. And I got these Helps in the sunlight a little bit. We'll open we'll these up a little bit. I'll open them all the way just because I don't want it to be too bright here. It's fine coming in. I don't have lines on these windows. I'm going to tie these back because Mason's fur, baby. Mercury. See? On the rug right there. He's being behaved right now. But he enjoys climbing curtains. <laughs> so I got these tied a all while back. I couldn't find them not too long ago. I just tied them back on this one over here. I gotta be perfect for how much stuff I need. We're gonna start off in the kitchen, so I'll show you before. <sighs> Not too bad, but in my big head. Things laying down. Living room mostly gets just kind of what I call scattered. And I may do a little bit outside. We'll see how I feel after I get through all this. So, tip y'all for today. Sometimes when you power hours too much and you just want to, oh, it's going to be too bright. Let's try this one over here. That'll work just fine. And you just want to clean. I spilled coffee on myself earlier. You just want to clean. You can do a calm, peaceful cleaning.
And then I'll wash my hands. These are dirty dishes. I know me. Using that refill of the honey vanilla. Or vanilla honey, I always say it backwards. And I like to change my towels and washcloths out. Scrub the sink and we let this wash on. Scrub. Let me tell you what's in the sink. Few tiny pieces of like food. Yeah, like hamburger or something. Yeah. It's right here. Put this away. This goes in the hall bathroom because I was doing my thing yesterday. It's a little dark over here. That's completely okay. It's not really dark. It's just not as bright because of that light. My husband said he would change it one of these days. Just have so much going on, y'all. Oh my goodness. But we got the grace of God and just a lot of change. Some of you may know more. Some of you may not. So, and a couple of my friends do know more. Because we're close friends, and all around or something. You can either do a scrub before or after. I like to do mine before and after. A lot of times in the morning and at night. Sometimes I only get some once a day. But it never hurts to do it twice. Get the gunk out of there. That's food and stuff. Sauces and stuff off your plates. Get down in the bottom of the sink. Let's clean this just real quick. Silverware. Okay. 
Take a rag and wipe it off before I start. Dust or whatever. And most of the time I dry and put my dishes away, I don't always get around to that. But Mason goes back to school on Monday, so. Hey, I am gonna need this light. What's wrong? One? There we go. It's not right in your eyes, hopefully. Try to make it where y'all can see me, but it's not right. Ooh. It's kind of bright, but it's not right up in your eyes. Try to kind of lock it a little bit. If you're new here, I want to welcome you in. We are a variety channel, so we just upload the type of videos and content we enjoy. We do it for fun. I do have certain videos on my planner decoration that a lot of the ladies like seeing. And also, I have the Sunday reset, y'all, which we will be doing tomorrow. We appreciate each and every one of you. We used to be to a set schedule and now we just do it for fun and hobby. If we ever hit our goal, that would be great. But we're not focused on all that. I bring a little bit of cleaning, the Lord's Word, Day in the Lives, random videos, or maybe the fur babies and stuff, the weather sometimes. We we'll definitely enjoy having you here. And I do hand wash all my dishes, no dishwasher. I've never used one. A few times I've had one that much. This is my preference. So it's good to give you coffee pot again. You can wash it in with the dishes. You don't have to do it that way. But it never hurts. Give it a good clean. You know. Here. I'm just popping it down with a soapy rag. Twat or wash and rinse it out. Pull it out because it's cam that's kind of tall. And I use a little bit of white vinegar and water and run through it and hit the clean button. Not all coffee pots, most of them do though anymore. They have that uh, either to say self clean or just clean button. 
so that you can go in and wipe them down. So, it's always important. These are not the one I'm crazy about. They didn't have my fish daddies. It's got like the little soft one and the scrub on the back. They didn't have the ones I was looking for, but they do okay. And it's like nine thirty here. Oh, area. We had a lot of rain and some hail the other day. Only lasted for not even ten minutes, I think. I want to try to mop the floors. I don't want to make this video too long because I do got other stuff. Like, I need to definitely get some more done on my math class, even though it's a Saturday. And can I say hello? Please? Yes, you can come say hello real quick. Come on. Sitting in your kids' place. Hey, Super Mario 2. Check out my level. It's called My World. I upload this course. Super for Mario. It. Yeah, he can make his own levels on one of his games. Well, you need to choose which one you want to do yeah. with. So. Okay, there we go. I need to mop some of bowl some water. The back in the mop. And if I don't do it in this part, I will bring back a second video. But I, I've been trying to bring at least a good hour or so long videos for y'all. I had a day in a life, but the video editor was acting weird, so I never did get a chance to upload that one. It's okay. Away. Some of them. I have more room on the strainer. I'm not worried about because I'm always scared I have to put my hand on one of these and broke it. Around, so I'm always kind of nervous with a coffee pot. I'm not worried about it. that means I start drying a little bit on that.
They said we won this cup. They had a drawing contest that they were doing in their cafeteria at school. And you won. It's one of the gifts that says, with surf ups, with school breakfast. They had a drawing, which was really cute and fun to watch. A lot of good drawings, too. Okay, that'll be enough, and I can rob us later. Let's get this done. Let's try these few and get, get it wiped down. And then we'll get this thing a small little scrub again. I gotta clean this cabinet out one day. Husband's still in bed. Lucky safe by a whipping bus is hard. You don't get up till daddy gets up. Because I just don't have the energy. Let me go grab a microfiber rag. Microfiber, you can't hear me say enough good things about these. I'm going to press these out real quick. And then give it one last tiny scrub. I'll just rinse that thing out. Put 
soak. Mm, that is like a cleaner type sink, y'all. So I'm gonna. I'm going to take a call over my sink. Stop laying down. Some people like seeing this. Ugh. See if I can hold you into it. Get a ramp. Now I'll just flap the top bar. I think that's a pretty. That's just fine. I have that mat. I'll get my lap saw. I've got another microfiber rag. I bought it from Dollar Tree. But I got a clean one here too. So I got two of them. And before I do this, I'll just go ahead and put some water out of here. Just soapy water and it was clean. So yeah, that's the first part. All it needs is a little bit, you know. You can use Here it is. a shiner, life saw, soft scrub works really good. Whatever works the best for you. Making sure you get water up out of spots. Very important. You don't wipe really good or you use, wring out your cloth enough for a dry one and you leave water. Trust and believe. Even if you got the cleanest home, the ant or a little bug will find it. They are resourceful is what I like to call them when it comes to uh, water and fluids. Very resourceful. That's why you gotta kinda Keep things dry up as you can. That's what I like to call you off here. Even these tray things you use, you use a dish drainer. Some people like to use a towel. I don't like to do that. I like to drain her that way I can. Wipe it up, and I feel like I gotta take it somewhere or go throw it in the washer right away. And then you can take and kind of wipe it up nice and neat when you're done with your dishes. And yes, it might be extra time you have to spend on it, but that's okay. Cleaning should be how it works for you. It shouldn't be. I'll, I'll put a link and I have put before the food family and the way he does it. And the way they work together on stuff, that's how you create a beautiful home and a beautiful space. I mean, I can give you tips all day, like not leaving water, which you shouldn't, but still do it your way, ultimately, you know. That's the beauty of cleaning. So do you feel comfortable? That answer is yes, that's a good thing. If that answer is no, you graduate a little by little. Don't do it all at once. Find areas where whether it needs to be decluttered, wiped down, clean, reorganized, whatever. 
and you do it. Yes, y'all, I leave my fall stuff out. Sometimes I pack it away, most time I leave it out. I didn't really do a spring decorate, I just sp spring decorate. Spring is, I like spring, but I like well, fall and winter much better. So I just, I literally, see these rags, what's good about microfiber? Let's watch. You see, a little damp, but it pulls all that nasty grime and dirt and things that you wouldn't want, wouldn't expect in the kitchen. I need that. And I can tap on the screen and tell you, listen to me, listen to me, because a lot of you ask for my tips and advice. Don't beat yourself up if you don't get it done the way someone else expects you to get it done, the way you think it should have been done. Try again later. Do the best you can and move forward. Take that from literally personal growing learning experience from being a YouTuber and not just on YouTube, just in my everyday life. I'm just gonna wipe these down real quick. A little bit of life saw. Sometimes I scrub them not today though. Always come back in and scrub them another day. Not today. We didn't really use but one burner in the back. I see like dust and stuff there, see. Or stone. So a lot of the stains don't even come off. See, for me, like, I want to do cleaning. But at the same time, I know I've got other stuff. I've got to get through math. I've got to get stuff done. Hopefully out in the yard after all the rain we had it move things around. Alright. So I'll have all day to stress out. Things being just perfect. Up on the kitchen table real quick. Put this back. So many people are starting to like the courses that I uploaded. That's good. Do the kitchen table real quick and I'll show you the kitchen. I knew it was a good idea to make my own world. Oh. Mm -hmm. We're going to uh, say, do I want to pour water? I'm going to try to. Let me get this part done. Cup. I'm sitting in another room. I'm gonna have to vacuum either of these guys. Not in this video. <laughs> Not really no crumbs up here, more like that. That old head we got this over for oh my goodness, it's been eleven years now. Long time. Long time. One of these had something on it. Let me 
I need to get some more table placement. Oh, I got the Sarah's I think it's cute. So, I'll be end up moving it soon. The cup goes on it, but that makes the table want to rattle. Do the walk around. So, kitchen area. Let me show you the kitchen area. He's going to dirty clothes table. Dishes all put away nice and tidy and clean. Let's work on this living room. I'm going to give you more of a before than I showed you before. I did show you a while ago, though. There's stuff laying around mostly scattered. Okay, so put y'all right here, actually. Turn off his white lights. I need to do I'm testing your little Pluto's over here under the cover. Hold on, Pluto. Hey, so I'm going to stop saying, hey, did you cover under the cover right there? I'm not doing anything, Mommy. You're messing your book. What is it? Your book. That's just, oh, thank you. I don't even need this one. They get kind of bright. I want to put, um, there's a little spot on this one. I want to grab another one of those. Put on those. And I just use pillowcases, bigger pillowcases. Mom, look what it has on the cover. A little kitty. Looks like Mercury. Looks like he's a little kitty. And like Clinton says, eat on the chum bug in our parish. Be nice to him, buddy. Let me grab those right there so we might change those before we vacuum. The regular pillowcases. Y'all want one of those that I can save a dollar and make something work? I don't use these as much. Let's do this. Kinda, these are old pillows that come off the other couch. I just say, let's keep them on this one. They're stained. They're too big for throwing even the bigger washers at the laundry mat or my mom's. So, let's just take these off. Whoa, look at this. I see, buddy. Watch out. You got to move. Smart. Right. Mason, it's time for him to go back to school. We've been so bored. Had a nice spring break, but boy, oh boy. Work. In about two days, it's going to school. It's like, go back to school. I'm just Mom's going to be so happy. Now I'm glad for you to get to go back to school. You'll be so happy. I can get more done that. during the day. Bad day. Bad day. Bye. That looks so much better anyways. Slide it down. Just fold it. Okay. Straighten up this couch. And y'all not throwing it on. He's buried down at the bottom. Here, Mason, here's a fidget spinner. 
Be baby fidget spinner. Come put your book where it goes. Book. All right. Bye. I take this off, y'all. Can't hide. Oh, I take it. I can't wait. Uh, I think these are just pillowcases. I have so many pillowcases too. And I bought the little snowflake ones. I finally did take off the couch and I was like, oh. I might as well pull this forward because I'm going to be taking up the rug, the vacuum. The shoes stay out here. We just want to move them in a different spot. Watch out, Mertz. Watch out, Mertz. Watch out, Mertz. Mertz is like, what are we? What are we doing? What are we doing? The rug. Throw that down the hallway. Phew. I need to wipe that microwave off. I didn't get it. Take this one off. Yeah. Alright, so I'm not going to vacuum and mop. I might do that. I can work in here with y'all. Let's win Dix's table. Because my husband's still sleeping out in the room. I was going to do it. I was like, eh, he don't mind. He always tells me to go ahead. No, he's not going to do that. Oh, wait. I don't know why this table is moving. I think it's not the table. I think it's the floor. I want to get big old area rugs, but I'm not going to pay tons of money. And if it's not even rolling out the floor, needs a lot of work back to it. My landlord knows that. So. It's not going to do it. I buy them off of different uh, shops. But this is going to be cleaned out one day. It's a mess. I kind of like to do this one in the front. Over here where it goes. Everything back to room. A spray and then I got my little desk area. This says Hawaiian Hello Hi. Yep, still a false set, y'all. Trash, but let me put it out right here so you can kind of see my desk area is not really a mess, mess, but it just got a few things I need to pick up for where I go. Sharpie paper. It's normally stays up and underneath my desk because I carry different purses. I don't know forever in a day to swap them. Use it from that. I don't want to 
to. I don't really get crumbs on it too bad. It's got a few things, but that is that. Take this trash out real quick. All right, y'all, that's going to do it for now. I'll show you. Think about your home as not only your home, but God's home, you know. Something the Lord gives you. It doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be excellent. You just put your best foot forward. Do the best you can. Be thankful whether you live in something fancy and new or you live in something old that needs a lot of love and a lot of work. Be blessed. Like and subscribe. I'll see you later. Bye.